So today we'll look at some of the new features that we've added in the settings and maintenance module that you might have missed uh, in the process. We've added an extra feature where you can create an additional button on the company card that will automate some manual tasks that you would otherwise have to do one by one. Uh, and we do this by using a CRM script. And a CRM script automates manual tasks by, by creating different documents or activities automatically for you when you press the button. So let me give you an example. For example, if you've just added a prospect to your database and you want to book an appointment with them, but you also have to create a new uh, customer visitor document and you want to create a new sales opportunity. With this new button on, in the screen designer, you can run a script that does all these three things automatically. So that when you as a user press the button, SuperOffice will automatically create the appointment for you in your diary. It will create a document for the customer report and it will create a new sales opportunity so that you don't have to go into these different, different parts of SuperOffice to do that manually, which of course will save you a lot of time. So if you would like to use this feature and you don't, you're not familiar with CRM scripts, please contact your uh, account manager in SuperOffice because they will be able to help you or point you in the right direction. We have now made a change to the address line on the screen designer in SuperOffice. The screen designer, as you know, is where you can configure and customize the, the company screen so that it only contains the information that you and, as a user and your company wants to use. Now, the address line normally would take up multiple lines where it would show the, the street, the zip code, and um, the city. Now you have the option to choose whether you want to have the old um, two-line address line, or you can switch to a single-line address where you don't see maybe all the details straight away, but you do see the most important part of the address. And that way, you can save a little space on the company card. I've got one more thing that I would like to share with you today. And yes, I went and got a haircut. In last month's product roundup, I was joined by my colleague Jan Petter, who talked about the mobile CRM app. He mentioned that they were working on a new feature called the caller ID. And I'm happy to report that this feature has now been released. For those who didn't watch last month's episode, let me quickly explain what the caller ID feature does. As you know, your phone is one of the most important work tools that you have. Every day you make and receive a lot of calls. And if you know who you're calling or who is calling you, you can always pick up the phone in a very personal way. But sometimes it happens that you're not able to pick up the call straight away um, or you don't see that you're being called at all. Um, and in that case, you want to be able to call back people afterwards. And then it would be nice to, to know who it was that called you. Um, but if you haven't saved the person's name in your phone, you won't be able to see who it was that called you. With the caller ID feature or mobile CRM, you can always see who is calling you as long as this person is either saved in, SuperOffice, uh, in your SuperOffice database or saved on your mobile device. This has several advantages. First of all, you can see who's calling you and pick up the phone in a personal way. The second advantage is that when you get a call and you're in a meeting, for example, you can choose whether you want to pick up the phone now or call this person back later. And the third and final advantage is, of course, that if you have a missed call, then you can easily see who it was that called you so you can see whether and when you want to call them back. The caller ID feature is part of the mobile CRM app. And this app synchronizes with your SuperOffice database on a daily basis. So any new contacts that are added to your SuperOffice database will be available in the app and therefore will also work with the caller ID function. For those who haven't downloaded the, um, the mobile CRM app yet, make sure to go to the App Store or Google Play and download it today. So in short, the caller ID will help you to give you a more personal touch to the phone calls that you make with colleagues, partners, suppliers, and customers. And we'll make sure to share the article that explains how you can set up the caller ID on your mobile CRM app.
We really hope you guys enjoyed the show. As always, the resources will be in the links down in the description. So make sure to check those out. Thank you for watching and see you next month. Mm -hmm.